So for any of you that may be wondering exactly how did I get my sliding glass door to automatically open and close in order to allow our dog to go outside and get inside without having to get off the couch, here's a complete explanation. Yes, you can do this yourself too. So here's a quick demo. Alexa, open the back door. Alexa, close the back door. Alexa is hooked up to our wireless internet. Our internet comes into the house through this modem and is then sent out through this wireless router to various locations. I have a number of devices that are hooked up that the Amazon Echo is able to communicate with. So when I tell the Echo to open the back door, it then sends a signal to this wireless router. The wireless router then sends a signal to this power strip which is connected to the internet and that the Echo can control. So the first signal it sends is to outlet number one, which you see over there, to activate. Right now, that outlet is not active. Once it sends a signal to activate that outlet, that outlet is connected to a solenoid, which is connected to the air compressor, running at just shy of 30 PSI. So once that outlet is activated, this solenoid would open, allowing the air to travel from the air compressor back over into the other room. The air runs to this secondary solenoid. Now, when this solenoid is powered down, the air is automatically in one position. Once the power is activated to the solenoid, it switches and pushes air through another valve to another position. So, when that air kicks on that first time and this solenoid is not powered on, the air travels from one port to this rather large actuator that I have mounted up here. So right now the air is in this position which is forcing that actuator to be in the open position, forcing the door to be closed. The echo will then activate outlet number two which is connected to that solenoid. Once the power is active, like I said, it switches to the other outlet on the solenoid, closes air to the first one, and pushes air through the second one, which is that port right there, which then closes the solenoid, which is what allows the door to open. Once the door is open, we reverse the process in order to close the door. We turn off the power to that second outlet, which then switches that solenoid to push the air through this other, the original valve with the power off, which then closes the door. Once that happens, the echo sends a signal back to this solenoid in order to turn it off. Once this solenoid shuts off, the air is expelled, and therefore there's no more pressure in the system, allowing us to open and close the door by hand as normal. So it's quite simple, really. You simply set up routines through the Amazon app, and I have a variety of routines set up. So let's do this one, which will automatically open, wait a period of time, and then close the door. So we call this one Alexa. Let the puppy out. So that's how I did it. Alexa, thank you. You're welcome.